This video shows a brief demonstration on how to remove and replace a cylinder on the LT150. This video shows how to do this with the knitting still on the cylinder, but of course it could be done after dropping the knitting. The first step is to remove the weight from the knitted material. Also remove the strap, the wire hook, and the knurled roll. Raise needles so that they are above the slide cam. The slide cam is always directly in front of the yarn guides. Be sure to remove all latch guards that are attached to the cam shell. Remove the yarn from the yarn guide. Reposition the yarn coming in towards the center of the cylinder. Feel along the inside of the cylinder for the tangs that drive the river cone. Use those as handles to pull straight up on the cylinder. Carefully lift the cylinder with the needles and the knitting straight up and place it on the yarn shelf in the rear of the machine. Here is a view of the inside of the LT150's camshell. Prior to returning a cylinder back into the camshell, it's important that the cylinder plungers are pushed down and flush with the top surface of that green nylon. Using the tangs on the ID of the cylinder as handles again, Carefully lift the cylinder and insert the knitting down through the center of the camshell. Orient the cylinder so that the needles that are raised are above the slide cam and carefully drop the cylinder down through the camshell. While carefully rotating the cylinder by hand, Rotate the cylinder while pushing up on a cylinder plunger until it falls in place. Be sure to insert the second cylinder plunger as well. Rotate the camshell until the yarn guide is in position so that you can reposition the yarn into the yarn guide. Reattach the knurled roll, the wire hook, and the weighted strap. Rotate the camshell as usual and lower all the needles that were raised above the slide cam. Don't forget to check that all latches are open and to reattach the latch guard wires as I did in this video. Ah, bummer. Thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful and please keep those questions coming. We'll do our best to keep adding instructional videos.